Now back to our top story. Detectives arrest a Fresno man outside of a technology repair shop after they say they found him in possession of child pornography. Fox 26 News reporter Myra Franco explains how the shop and detectives work together to make the arrest. Myra? Liz Monty, the Fresno County Sheriff's Office credits the UTech repair shop for its swift action in alerting authorities on Internet crimes against children. It says the evidence was on a device a customer took in for repairs. Whenever, you know, whenever we're going through and just doing like routine service, it's something that you're never expecting to see. You're never really prepared to see anything like that. The co-owner of UTech, Michael Brown, says a few weeks ago, a customer brought in a phone for repairs. Not only was something wrong with the phone, he says they spotted something else that didn't seem right. Once we had checked it in, gone through the diagnostics on the home screen, we had noticed some um, pretty questionable like history sites as well as um, websites that were definitely like leading to not normal explicit content, um, stuff that was mainly tailed, tailored towards minors. He says they contacted authorities right away. They came across some disturbing uh, photos, videos on this customer's phone that they were trying to fix. Um, you know, they did a fantastic job of quickly identifying, hey, this is not normal stuff that people should have on their phones. Um, there was child sexual abuse material that was on there. The Central California Internet Crimes Against Child Task Force Agency worked with UTEC to arrest 46-year-old Andrew Castaneda. Brown says as soon as Castaneda pulled into the parking lot to pick up his phone Monday, they took him into custody. He was arrested and bonded out hours later. Every time we take one of these people off the street, um, we're potentially saving a child because we know that a lot of times this behavior is progressive. They, they like to be voyeurs and, and download and look, uh, but then when does it stop? Does it reach a threshold where they want to go hands on with a victim? That's our biggest fear and that is what we were in place to try and prevent. Deputies say Castaneda is due in court on August 14th. He is facing a felony charge in possession of child pornography. If convicted, he will face time in prison and will have to register as a sex offender. Monty Liz. All right, thank you, Myra. But he also says the investigation is still underway. He says if Castaneda is found distributing the material, that will be a separate charge. And that is not the only person being accused of child sex crimes. Tuesday, Fresno County Sheriff's deputies arrested 41-year-old Manuel Cárdenas. Deputies tell us they, posted, they posed as an 8-year-old girl online in an effort to catch child sex predators. We're told Cárdenas agreed to meet with the pretend child in order to have sex with her. Now they say when he, was, he went to the scheduled spot, he was arrested and booked into Fresno County Jail. He's now facing several felony charges, including arranging to meet with the minor with the intent of having sex.